what's up guys welcome back to my channel i hope you are all doing great you are all doing well and welcome back to this new episode in this video i'm going to review a perfume from the house of rehan once again and this one comes from their imperia collection they have like three perfumes in their imperia collection and i have already reviewed one out of them and that one was rehan imperia for him and you can check out the detailed review on my channel if you are interested and this one is one of the best alternative of creed eventus and now today in this video i'm going to review another one from the collection and that one is rehan imperia intense for him from their imperia collection so let's start a review and in this video i'm going to tell you that how this perfume actually smells is it good is it bad and we will talk about everything regarding this perfume so let's start a review and as always we will start with the presentation first so you will find this perfume in this kind of paper box you can see the design pattern it's a glossy box one of the half is in black and the other half is uh, printed with this golden design pattern you can see here and the name of the brand rehan then the name of the perfume imperia intense and the name of the collection imperia collection and the same pattern goes in the back like the half of the box is black and half of the box is with this uh, golden design pattern the name of the brand here in this cutout once again and all the ingredient details in the bottom your batch code your manufacturing date everything is here in the bottom so this is the box and now let me show you the bottle and the bottle is very similar to imperia for him and here you go the only difference is the name of the perfume and the color of printing in case of imperia everything was printed in white and here in case of imperia intense the whole printing is done in gold and this bottle gives you like more royal and rich kind of uh, feel here you can see the design pattern in the back here which is printed in gold the color of the bottle is once again gray and it's a transparent bottle the name of the brand here rehan and the name of the perfume imperia intense and the cap here is made of plastic and there was a golden plastic ring here in the bottom but unfortunately i have dropped my bottle and that golden ring is broke it's gone but still the cap is working fine so this was about the presentation and now let's talk about the fragrance so let me give you the nose breakdown first and then i'm going to tell you that how this perfume actually smells so here in the top you will get star anise you will get cypress you will get pepper you will get tangerine and then in the middle you will get incense lavender orange blossom and vetiver and then in the base you will get cashmere wood vanilla musk and sandalwood so this is the official notes breakdown and now i will try to explain you that how this perfume actually smells so first of all this is a very fresh and soapy kind of fragrance you will find some citruses on the top you will get that soapiness there is a metallic kind of vibe here in the opening and then you will get some florals and some spices the opening is a little bit metallic here you will get that metallic kind of vibe here with that soapiness and then you will find some lavenders here lavenders are providing that floral and powdery kind of a vibe here you will get some citruses and then you will get a combination of some florals i can smell uh, geranium and jasmine uh, very clearly here and then finally you will get a note of warm and spicy clove in the back there are some cloves in the base in the back and then you will get some leather here the leather here is not that smooth rounded and salty kind of leather but it's like industrial and a little bit hard and harsh kind of leather here so this is actually the structure of this perfume and this is how this perfume opens how this perfume starts what i love in this perfume is the dry down you can say like uh, from the second phase toward the dry down that part is what i love a lot and there in the, in the second phase when that soapiness fades away that's the time when you start to love it it becomes very classy it becomes like very sexy and a very beautiful kind of scent this perfume is going to give you that classy kind of vibe here and if you cannot handle a synthetic kind of uh, compositions and then you're not going to like it but if you are someone like me who love all kind of fragrances as long as they smells good then you are definitely going to love it and you can check it out and then finally in the dry down this perfume becomes a little bit woody a little bit more spicy that florals are going to stay with you all the time 
There is a brightness in this perfume from the beginning and that brightness stays with you till the end. So it becomes a little bit more spicy and a little bit you can say more woody in the dry down. But still you feel that kind of brightness, those citruses are going to stay with you. Those florals will be there with you till the end. A beautiful composition, a very nice blend. And the feel of this perfume is you can say like a little bit sexy, rich and classy so this was about the fragrance of rehan imperia intense and if you like these kind of fragrances you like like designer kind of fragrances and you don't care much about that and natural smelling ingredients then you are definitely going to like it for me i really enjoyed it the first 15 to 20 minutes are too soapy for me and that's my personal liking that's my personal choice but after that this becomes a beautiful composition very classy. So this was about the fragrance of Imperial Intense. And now let's talk about the other aspects of this perfume. So first of all, the inspiration behind this perfume. I heard people saying that this is a fusion of Crete's Silver Mountain Water and Perfume de Marles Pegasus. But to my nose, it's not like that. Yes, you will get that feel of Crete Silver Mountain Water here. You'll get that kind of uh, metallic notes here in the beginning. You will get that bright and sharp citrusy, that bright florals here. But there is no Pegasus here because Pegasus is a perfume based on almonds and powdery sweet vanilla. It's powdery, it's very sweet. There are some almonds, it's very creamy kind of scent. But on the other hand, here, you will not get that kind of creaminess. You will not get that kind of nuttiness here. There are no almonds. There is no strong kind of sweet vanilla here. It's a different kind of scent. To my nose and as per my experience, this is a mix of Crete's Silver Mountain Water and Opulent Shake Classic Number no. 77 from the house of Shake. Shake is a Middle Eastern house. It's a niche Middle Eastern house or you can say it's a royal house because this is a house owned by the royal family of Bahrain. So here you will find Creed's Silver Mountain Water which is around like 35% to 40% and the rest of 60 to 65% is Opulent Shake Classic Number no. 77. So this was about the inspiration behind this perfume and now let's talk about the other aspects of this perfume. First of all, performance. Performance 10 on 10. This is a very long lasting scent, 8 to 10 sprays on your fabric and you are going to rock whole day you will be able to smell this perfume on your shirt or on your t-shirt even on the next day yes it will become soft but it will be there so longevity is great one day you can say or strong like 10 to 12 hours projection and sillage once again is very good people around you will be able to smell it easily and now let's talk about gender so this is a pure masculine scent and if you talk about the age group if you are like around the age of 19 20 you can rock it and now let's talk about uh, the season or weather so this is a perfume which you can use all year around but for the best experience use this perfume in summers this is a perfume to be used when the weather is hot and now let's talk about the occasion so this is a perfume which is amazing for outdoors and if you are going in like uh, weddings if you are going for shopping in the mall you are going for picnic if you want to wear this perfume in your office uh, just control the number of sprays like you can start with like three to four sprays because this is very strong and it's very potent so you can start with like three to four sprays for the office and you can check it out by yourself and then you can adjust it as per your liking uh, but for the outdoors start with like eight to ten sprays and you can go for picnics for parties you can go for malls for shopping in your gym for your sports activities if you are going for lunch or dinners there are people to whom you want to impress use this perfume so this was about the occasion and now let's talk about the price so you will get this perfume in 100 ml quantity with this uh, beautiful bottle with this beautiful presentation and the price of this perfume inside uae is 50 uae dirhams and the good news here is that the website of uh, rehan perfumes is updated and it's working the stock is available there you can order from their website if you're looking inside uae the stock is there the website is uploaded with a new uh, design and it's looking very nice. I'm going to put all the links and contact numbers in the description. You can check it out. In Pakistan, it's available with Mr. Umar. In India, it's available with uh, my very dear brother Ashish Bhai, the owner of Fragaholic.in. 
And in UAE, you can buy this perfume directly from their official website. So this was about the Rehan Imperia Intense. I hope you liked this review and I'm going to catch you in my another video of an another great product. Till then, put your scent on, stay fragrant and bye.